Here they are. A late Christmas present from Chaos. Red to Akari. So far, three beautiful solid colored babies. Pretty amazing out of a cat with so much white. But she has a black daddy. So the ability to make solid colored kittens is in there. And I bred her to Chaos, who's a solid brown tabby. And the first kitten out is a beautiful, believe it or not, because I didn't see it until she was totally dry, a brown patched tabby. Solid, with no white. Very cute little face, great little tail. And I saw the red spot on her hind end, and I was like, oh my god, she's a brown patched tabby. Oh, she's really cute. Got an excellent singing voice. And the second girl out, of course, I, I can't even believe this is possible, but I, I have to say to Scott, can you pinch me and make sure I'm still awake? Because this is something I've been waiting for for a million years. It looks like a silver tabby girl. But as she gets drier and drier, I think I was just excited and hoping for a silver tabby. I think she's really a brown tabby. And no patching that I can see. So a brown tabby. Looks like she's mostly mackerel. And a girl. God, I wish she was a silver tabby. I'd even take silver tabby with tinge. Anyhow, another girl, so I'm very happy about that. Yeah, I see as she dries, she looks more and more like a brown tabby. And the third girl is a solid black. Yes, she's beautiful. She's got really, I don't know, might be a long hair. Wouldn't that be cool? She has a little bit of a longer tail. That's sometimes what you get with the solid, I mean, with the long hair kittens. It's in proportion to their longer coat, and it looks just fine when they're adults, but when they're first shot of the hopper, it looks a little longish. Anyhow, solid black girl. Well, that's what she's had, and I think that's it. So far she's put out the kittens, no afterbirths, and I think, I don't know if there's anything else in there. She's a good mom, yes you are, she's out of Jenny, so she's a really special girl. Beautiful silver, silver pattern Mike with bright, bright green eyes, she's an excellent mother, and I was lucky enough to get her back from my friend Tony Huff in Texas. And so, this might be her last hurrah, but at least I get a kitten out of a very special girl who's out of my other very special girl named Ginny. Okay, well that's it for now. We'll let you know if more kittens are coming in in the future. But I think that's it.